Hey, what's going on, people? Your boy, Matt Mike Kevin. Before we get started, please hit that subscribe button. Tell your friends to come check Falcons football with your boy. And let's get straight to it, man. Falcons signed defensive tackle Terrell McClain, formerly of the Dallas Cowboys. And last year with the Washington Redskins, the Redskins signed him for a three-year, $21 million. Just didn't fit with those guys. Just didn't pan out. Um... Guy's an excellent player. All right, he's a pretty good player. I wouldn't say excellent, but he's a pretty good player. He does what he does best, and that's penetrate, get to the quarterback. And, you know, again, those are the type of quarterbacks, uh, defensive players, and defensive linemen that Dan Quinn loves. Not necessarily big, you know, physical uh, run. Uh, well, you got these fat uh, run stoppers like a Duntari Pose, like 330, 340 pounds. Who just you know just gonna stand there, uh, stop the run, and not do much in the pass uh, rushing department. And that's exactly what Duntari Poe was. The Falcons tried to get him uh, to lower his weight a bit so he can try to get to the quarterback. Just didn't happen. He had two sacks on the year, and it just wasn't a fit for the Falcons, um, especially with the pay that he was asking for. I think he was asking for like twenty million dollars a year. For a guy that is primarily the run stopper, no, the Falcons are not doing that. So the Falcons, when you know, Falcons fans thought that they would get a defensive tackle in the first round of the pick, they weren't happy. You know, some were happy with the pick with Calvin Ridley, others weren't. Um, I had a video on that. Um, if y'all want to check that out, go through the you know, my draft uh, playlist. But again, man, the Falcons want, want players. That fit their scheme okay they want players to fit their scheme and they're not concerned about what everyone else is doing okay let me repeat that the Falcons aren't concerned what everyone else is doing they have a plan they know what players that they want and they're not going to deviate from that plan and that is why I love Dan Quinn as a head coach he knows exactly the type of player he wants he gets fast fit physical speedy defensive players especially on the defensive line you have Grady Jarrett okay the guy was drafted in the fifth fucking round okay the fifth fucking round and he's an all pro under Dan Quinn so if you get a player you know if Dan Quinn gets a player in the fifth round um yeah and especially he's done this over and over again all the defensive players with the exception of Jalen Collins, and I don't think Jay, uh, this was the Dan Quinn pick. That was more of a Tommy, a Tommy Dimitrov pick. With the exception of Jalen Collins, this guy has done pretty damn well getting defensive players. So Dan Quinn knows what the fuck he's doing. So Falcons fans, relax, man. Dan Quinn got this. Tommy Dimitrov got this. They're sticking to their plan, and I absolutely love it. Uh, you have a rookie in Dean Sinat, Terrell McClain, Grady Jarrett, and you know, um, Derek Shelby can fill in in the defensive uh, tackle position. He's an excellent run stuffer. So the Falcons, man, this this defense is coming along well, man. And I'm not positive, and I'm not sure that this will be the last of possible signings for the Falcons. So Falcons fan, let me know what you think about this signing. Terrell McClain signed the deal with the Atlanta Falcons, man. Let me know what you guys think. Leave it comments below and let your boy Matt might go out, man. Please, I'm gone.